Hello everybody, welcome to today's video. Today we're continuing my let's play in the deep dark. In this video we're going to be uh, maxing out our gear and then at the end of the video we will be trying to kill the warden. So I was uh, looking around the ancient city, that my current one, and I ended up actually finding the ward armor trim in the one chest that I hadn't looted in the entire ancient city. So I just updated to 1.20 and so I'm pretty happy with that, which means because it means that I don't have to go looking for an armor trim. So I decided I would duplicate the armor trim and upgrade upgrade my armor with the armor trims. So I quite like the amethyst on the diamond, and so I went with amethyst on the diamond and gold on the rest. I then decided because I was kind of getting uh, my stuff all looking nice, I decided I would do a shield upgrade. And so it actually took me 10 minutes to find a spider to make the loom because I had no string. And it, just for two um, string, it took me 10 minutes, which was took quite it was quite a long time. I didn't really have that many dyes that I could use, so I just went with gray and white. Uh, I could have used blue, which I see that as I'm editing this, but uh, I didn't think about that back then. So this is what I went with. So now that I've got all of the trims on my armor, I now am going to be going off to a ancient city so that I can get some notch apples and regen pots for fighting the warden later on. I'm going to be using chunk base to find it as it's just I have to dig for ages uh, to actually find the ancient city. I'll just show you the chests that I actually took stuff from didn't actually end up taking the regen pots because I forgot about them. Uh, I spawned about six wardens, which was quite a lot. When I got back, I dropped everything that I had found off at my base. It took me a while to get back, so I mined a decent amount while I was out there. I also got a lot of bones, which is going to help as I, as ancient cities are the only real reliable source for bone meal without having to do a lot of uh, making azalea trees. I made a point of collecting all the books because that is what I wanted to do, because now I can finally get max enchants, which has been one of my goals from the start of the uh, series. I tried my hand at uh, doing some of this editing, showing my XP bar. Uh, put it down in the comments below if you like that or not. And so now it was time for the battle uh, between me and the warden. It took a while for me to spawn him in because I still had a few strikes left before I spawned him in. But eventually I got down to my last strike and the warden came. It was sad. It was it was really sad. So I now know not to fight him in a small enclosed area. I'll be coming back to this one time, sometime. Uh, but I am not going to continue making these videos. I'm going to be moving on to another series, and I will 
bring out another video uh, when I end up defeating the warden once I've got more gear because I now know that I need more gear especially seeing as though I can't get totems. So that's where we're going to end off. Thank you all for watching and I'll see you next time.